At number 10, we have Yamaha YZF-R1M. This has a top speed of 191 miles per hour or 307 km. This is its exhaust sound. The Yamaha YZF R1M is a track-focused 1000cc superbike super that has gained popularity among enthusiasts worldwide. So this boasts Yamaha's cross-plane technology with ride-by-wire controls. R1M is equipped with a wide range of electronics that monitor the external situations and help adjust the bike's dynamic accordingly. Yamaha has integrated lightning-fast quick-shifting, electronically adjustable dampers, and multiple riding modes to enhance the overall riding experience. This aggressive and aerodynamic bodywork allows R1M to cut to the air seamlessly. At number 9, we have Suzuki Hayabusa. This has a top speed of 194 miles per hour or 312 kilometers per hour and this is how the exhaust sounds. The Suzuki Hayabusa has long been known as one of the fastest production motorcycles in the world. Since its debut in 1999, it has held the crown of the fastest bike and has become synonymous with speed. The 2020 model features a 1340cc 4-cylinder DOHC engine, advanced EFI with fuel injectors and dual RAM air intakes. The Hayabusa offers excellent handling in tight corners and is also suitable for touring. Suzuki has included different drive modes that help you adjust the power delivery for different riding conditions. Overall, Hayabusa is a complete package if you are looking for an adventure. At number 8, we have Aprilia RS V4 1100 Factory. This bike has a top speed of 199 miles per hour, 320 km per hour. And this is what the exhaust sounds like. Aprilia has made significant improvements to the RS V4 1100 factory, making it a strong contender in its class. The revised bodywork, seamless winglets, and large windscreen enhance the aerodynamics, especially during track runs. The 1078cc V4 delivers a maximum of 217 horsepower, allowing the motorcycle to reach a top speed of 199 miles per hour. Despite its performance, RSV4 complies with Euro 6 emissions, sorry, Euro 5 emissions standards without compromising its exhaust and power delivery. The bike features advanced equipment including the Onhill's semi active suspension system, which enables easy switching between different modes. At number 7, we have BMW S1000 RR. Finally, a BMW motorcycle with a top speed of 200 miles per hour or 322 kilometers per hour. And this is how its exhaust sounds like. The BMW S1000 RR is a hardcore superbike designed to push the boundaries of motorcycle engineering. It may not be the fastest bike on this list, but it carries the reputation and confidence that comes with the BMW Sport. The 1000 RR is powered by 999cc liquid cool inline force engine producing 205 horsepower and 83 pound-feet of torque. BMW's shift cam technology ensures optimal power delivery in various riding conditions. With its combination of power and performance, the S1000RR offers an exhilarating riding experience. At number 6, we have Ducati Panigale V4R. 
It has a top speed of 204 miles or 329 kilometers per hour. And this is how the exhaust sound like. The Ducati Panigale V4R is the embodiment of maximum performance from a road legal Ducati superbike. The R in the name stands for racing version and it lives up to its expectation. The V4R's power plant can unleash up to 234 horsepower making it the most powerful road legal motorcycle. With its aerodynamic and electronics package, the V4R is truly the king of superbikes capable of reaching a top speed of 204 miles per hour. At number 5, we have Kawasaki Ninja ZX-14R. This bike has a top speed of 208 miles or 335 km per hour. And this is how this exhaust sounds like. <laughs> The Kawasaki Ninja ZX-14R is the top-of-the-line model for the ZX series. Powered by a 1441cc inline 4 engine, this bike generates 208 horsepower and 113 pound of torque. It features a unique monoscoque design and comes equipped with an advanced features such as ABS dual power mode, traction control and dual intake valves. With the top speed of 208 miles per hour, the Ninja ZX-14R is a powerful machine that offers a thrilling riding experience. At number 4, we have Honda CBR 1000RR. This has a top speed of 211 miles per hour, 341 kilometers per hour. And this is how the exhaust sound like. <laughs> The Honda CBR1000RR Fireblade SP is a Honda's flagship superbike, drawing inspiration from its MotoGP sibling. With a tired and tested but upgraded inline 4 cylindrical engine, it delivers 214 horsepower to the rear wheel. The Fireblade SP features a perfectly calibrated chassis, weight distribution, and suspension setup, making it a brilliant track machine. Its exterior design and tricolor livery and titanium exhaust enhances its sporty DNA. The CBR1000RR is a formidable contender in the road legal track oriented superbike segment. At number 3, we have Lightning LS218. This is an electric bike with a speed of 218 miles per hour or 351 km per hour. And this is how its exhaust sound like. The exhaust sound would not be the one that you expect from a superbike. LS218 stands out from the other motorcycles on this list because it is an electric bike. It features electric batteries instead of conventional fuel tank and produces no emissions. With an IPM liquid cooled 150 kilowatt engine, the LS218 generates 200 horsepower and 168 pound feet of torque. With a top speed of 218 miles per hour, this electric bike offers impressive performance while maintaining environmental friendly emissions. At number 2, we have Kawasaki Ninja H2. This bike produces a top speed of 227 miles per hour or 365 kilometers per hour. And this is how the exhaust sounds like.
Kawasaki Ninja H2 is a supercharged super sport bike powered by 998 cc engine which is in line 4 this produces 228 horsepower and 98.5 pound feet of torque it delivers exhilarating performance and has a very different look number 1 on the list is again Kawasaki Ninja H2R for this bike the top speed is 249 miles per hour and 400 kilometers per hour and this is how the exhaust sounds like. So this was it from the world of super bikes and the fastest that there is. I hope you like this video and do let me know in the comments below your favorite bike.